the most anticipated ghana vlog is finally here i honestly decided to vlog when i got to ghana so here's me in ghana So I ordered a boat ride because obviously I wasn't visiting anybody, I'm a tourist <laughs> and I got to this really cute hotel where I spent the night. Oh guys, I just got into my lodge and I'm so exhausted, I look like a mad person, I'm about to go take a shower and I have another flight tomorrow. Like back to back stress signing papers and all of that stuff like when i travel to dubai I literally didn't have to do this much and then they broke my box so my box is broken right now i need to find how to get another box but anyway i think about that tomorrow i woke up the next morning and then i was informed that i have complimentary breakfast so i went downstairs to have breakfast and yeah ghana food it slaps. Hi guys, good morning. I'm about to have my breakfast. I have another trip today to Taco Rally. After breakfast, I had to rush to the airport to catch my next flight to guess where? <laughs> So I found out that in Ghana, they have KFC drive through and So from Takoradi, we had to drive all the way down to Buswa because I wanted to go to Ahanta Waves so badly and finally here we are in Ahanta Waves. This is just nature and nature and all of it so nature. I arrived at Hunter Waves and I'm about to check it out. It has been such a long journey from the Takradi airport to here. It's just about over an hour. So I'm exhausted, but I hope I get to chill and relax. Is it funny? So guys, I'm introducing to you the Ahanta Waves Eco Lodge. I honestly love every, every single thing about this Eco Lodge because it's an Eco Lodge and it's the first time that I would be spending some time in an Eco Lodge, an actual Eco Lodge. The most amazing part is you can literally take a shower under the tree. They have an eco lounge in the area where you can sit by the bonfire at night or you can just be on that net swing or sit by the lake. This place is so cool. I ordered breakfast and it was prepared for me. This looks so good, you know, with the fruits and the tea and the French toast. I'm feeling like such a tourist. And here is my view. 
check it out guys i mean you want to be here okay you want to be here hey guys good morning it's a new day at a hunter waves and i'm about to have breakfast I was a bit scared, honestly, I won't lie. I know I'm very adventurous, but I was quite scared because the waves were quite rocky. But I mean, I trusted that they've been doing these things for years, so I'll be safe. I had so much fun on my first adventure in Ghana and it was time to go back to the Eco Lodge. So guys, I am going surfing for the first time in my entire life. So I'm going to learn how to surf actually. Uh, okay, let's get it. So guys, we're at the beach and I'm about to learn how to surf for the very first time in my entire life. We walked a long distance so I'm still panting but I'm excited. So guys, I'm about to start my surf lessons with the Ahanta Wave Surf Teacher. Okay, you 
black. When is more? When is more the the others? I just yeah. put it back. Yeah. These are the things. The things have the body to control. Yeah, like to control. But that the things like the to move anywhere. But you have the. So here comes my first attempt and I think this is honestly the funniest video of me ever. <laughs> like why did I fall? <laughs> And of course, I had to take some pictures for my mama. I'm sure she's watching this vlog right now. Oh my god, how did I do guys? How did I do good? So I had so much fun. I got back to my lodge for dinner and this meal is so tasty. Honestly, with the coconut juice. Guys, I'll be leaving our Hantel Waves Eco Lodge today, so I'm honestly going to miss this place. I've had so many memories that I will never forget. I'm heading back to Accra. So guys, I just arrived here and I'm about to go So we made Italian pizza with the Italian chef and I already made a vlog about this, so if you haven't watched it yet, you can watch it after watching this video, the link will be in the description box. And in the evening, I went out with Miss Budu, an influencer in Ghana. We had dinner and it was so much fun. The next day I touched down Sandbox, it's a beautiful restaurant with a beautiful view, like so beautiful. Aquaba. Let's go together. So I stopped at Chop Shop Ghana to try out some proper Ghanaian dishes and I started with the grilled fish and yam chips. What's the sauce called? This is the green chips. So I decided to try out the Ghanaian fufu and okra the way it's prepared in Ghana. So let's give this a shot. I'm about to try banko and okra, the famous banko. Guys, this is nice, like, look at 
again i had so much fun at top shop ghana time to go back to my lodge next day i went on a road trip to the aqua safari in ada ghana it was such a long trip look how i look so stressed out but then i'm about to cool off and enjoy the rest of my vacation so guys i just woke up and i'm on my way to go have breakfast so let's see what they'll be having for breakfast here. So after breakfast, I took a tour around my lodge and the entire aqua safari just to give you guys a proper view of what this place looks like. I mean, it's a vibe. It's serene. It has the greens. It has some, you know, animals around. It has some horses. It has, it's literally so chilled, you know. It has the water side where you can do the jet ski. It has so much stuff. It also has a pool side. And I went to chill by the pool at afternoon. so cool to find out that they vibe to a whole lot of nigerian music like it was just nigerian music back to back and some ghana music as well but more of nigerian music because i mean give it up for us nigerians we've got good and awesome music i didn't want to swim i just wanted to stick my legs in the pool and look around and you know vibe to the music and that's exactly what i was on so i didn't come in any swim work to swim because i did not want to swim loki i wish i actually swam and took pictures by the pool but i mean hi guys good morning it's my very last day in ghana and it's so emotional i feel like i'm gonna miss ghana so much going back to work yeah i can't lie i miss i miss my regular life still yes yeah, so i'm about to have breakfast and leave It was really time for me to leave and i honestly can't lie i had so much fun in this place it was just really so chilled and one thing they have fish ponds everywhere literally everywhere and they're so beautiful even on the counter they have fish ponds too i just did a little quick goodbye tour to this place and fun fact the sun in ghana actually burns like i look way darker but i mean that's all right that's tourism stuff going to the airport now before i miss my flight definitely have to add that the airport is so beautiful and so neat it was time for me to hop on the plane and you know just a quick selfie video and stuff <laughs> it's a really quick flight back to nigeria and i honestly had the best vacation ever don't forget to like comment subscribe and turn on post notifications to get notified when i drop my next video bye guys